Tracy Farah and I'm doing my UAH Biology Extra Credit project by doing a leaf collection. I collected all of my leaves by using a dichotomous key. Here's my collection. This leaf is a red bud. It is in the order Fabalis the family Fabacea and the genus Circus. This leaf is a hickory leaf. It is in the order Hugondales, family Huglandacea, and genus Correa. This leaf is a basswood. It is in the order Malvales, family Tilacea, and genus Tilia. This leaf's common name is sweet gum. It is in the order Hemamelidales, family Hemadalacea, and genus Liquid Dombar. This leaf's common name is cherry. It is in the order Rosales, family Rosacea, and genus Prunus. This is my favorite leaf. Its common name is Sassafras. Um, the order is Laurelace. The family is Laurasia. And the genus is Sassafras. This leaf, its common name is Ash. It is in the family Alacia, genus Braxinus, and order Scrophularias. This little leaf is the wild plum leaf. It is in the order Rosales, family Rosacea, and genus Prunus. This big leaf is the red mulberry. It is in the order Urtacales, family Moracea, genus Morris. This is the tulip tree leaf. Its order in, it is in the order Magnolia, Magnoliales, family Magnoliaceae, genus Lari Lyrodendron, excuse me, bear with me during the pronunciations. <laughs> um, this is the American Holly. It's in the order Celestrales, family Aquafoliaceae, and genus Lex. This leaf is the Sumac. It's in the order Sepindales, family Anarchidaceae, and genus Rus. This leaf is the persimmon leaf. It's in the order Ebonales, family Ebonacea, and genus Diospyros. It is also found upland. This leaf is in the order Sapindales, the family Hypocastanacea, and genus Esculus. This leaf is a Rhodosia dogwood. It's in the Cornalis order. The family is Cornacea and genus is Cornus. This leaf is the black locust leaf. It is in the order Fabales, family Fabacea, and genus Robinia. This big leaf here is a pawpaw leaf. It is in the order Magnolia Alice, family Anonacea, and genus Asimina. This little skinny leaf is a willow tree leaf. It is in the order Selicales, family Selicacea, and genus Salix. It is found lowland. This leaf is a chestnut oak leaf. Order Fagales, family Fagacea, Genus Quercus. This leaf is a hedge apple leaf. It is in the order Urticales, family Moracea, and genus Maclura. This leaf has little rigid edges. It is a Spanish elm. It is found in the order. Lamiales, family Bereginacea, and genus Corgia. 
This leaf is a sycamore leaf. The order's Hemimolatilase family is the Platinacea and genus is Platinus and it is found in lowland. This leaf is the black walnut leaf. The order is Hugondales, family is Huglandacea, and the genus is Huglans. It is found in upland. This leaf is the box elder. It was the hardest leaf for me to find. Um, it is in the order Sapindales, the family Acaracea, and the genus Acer. This leaf is the hatberry leaf. It is found in your it is in the order your tacles, family Omacea, genus Celtis, and it is found in lowlands. The name of this leaf is the sugar maple. Order Sapindales, family Acaracea, and genus Acer. It is found upland. This leaf is called the cottonwood leaf. Its order is Celicacea. It is in the family Celicacea, and the genus is Populus. This leaf is called the ironwood leaf. It's in the order Phagales, family Betulacea, and genus Astrea. This leaf is called the American beech. It is in the order of Phagales, family Phagacea, and genus Phagus. It is found upland. This is a cedar. Order Penales, family Cupressia, genus Thuha. And that concludes my leaf project. I hope you enjoyed my leaf collection as much as I did because I had a lot of fun collecting it and some of them were a little bit hard to find. Thank you.